This Let's Play features an adult using adult language. You have been warned. How's it going, folks? My name is Stephen Wolf. Welcome back to Let's Play Vampire the Masquerade Bloodlines. I think we saw a girl get kidnapped, so we should probably investigate that. can't remember if they came hauling ass from there or there. The Red Dragon Restaurant, let me guess. Excuse me? No. I'm pretty sure that's where we saw those guys haul ass away from. Um, I'm sorry. Dinner service stopped a little while ago. But our lounge is still open. Oh, that's fine. I'm here to see Wong Ho. Ming Zhao sent me. I'll get the elevator. Thank you. Second floor, have a good night. You as well. Damn. Where's the elevator? No more Yankee, my wanky. The Fenga need food. Fucking. That's offensive. Oh. Very cool. Hello. Why would I want to rush home oh, anyway? Oh, the second floor is an Elysium site. <laughs> what else? With a what? Oh, you're in the kitchen. Yeah, they were on they sale, took her. so I bought some. They took her. Two like zucchini. Who did they take? Kiki, my daughter. They grabbed her. They called and said, Wong Ho has meddled with Tong for the last time. This might not be the best time, but Ming Zhao sent me to talk to you. Ming Zhao? Oh, of course. Please forgive me, but as you can see, I am in a most terrible situation. I am Wang Ho, owner of the Red Dragon. Again, I apologize for my inconsiderate behavior. No apology necessary. What's going on here? The Tong. A local street gang here in Chinatown just broke into my restaurant and kidnapped my daughter at gunpoint. The Tong grow more bold every day, and now... They have my kiki. All right. That makes daddy angry. Who the fuck wrote that cringe ass line? Why would they take your daughter? I am a man of some prominence here in Chinatown. I have many allies, but there are also many who would like to see my demise. The Tong have chosen the coward's path, using my daughter as leverage against me. Sounds like I need to bring the wood. What do you have? Uh, leverage for what? I do not know. I will undoubtedly hear from the Tong very shortly. They will have demands, and then perhaps we will know more. All right. <clears throat> Any idea where they took your daughter? No. The Tong have many... Uh, wait. Please excuse me a moment. Of course. Hello. Zhao. Huh? Yes. How did you... Of course. I see. Thank you, my friend. Your debt has been repaid a thousand times over. Yes. Of course. Goodbye. That didn't sound like the tong. That was... Someone who owed me an old debt. It has been repaid. I know where the Tong are keeping my daughter. Good news. Well, tell me where. Just tell me where. 
And someone better call a coroner. Kiki is being held at the Lotus Blossom, a massage parlor here in Chinatown. If you bring her back to me, I will help you in any way that I can. All right. And then we get back to, then we get down to business. Thank you. I shall wait here until you return. Strike fast. The Tong will not be expecting anyone so soon. Good luck, my friend. See ya. Is there anything I can steal from this place? Make it worth my time. Oh. A throwing star. I just have a throwing star. When you wish upon a throwing star, you wish you had the skill to use the fucking thing. <laughs> that fucker is spinning fast. Dope. I should probably close the... Oh, the corner opens. That's kind of cool. That's how you do a room divider. Was there something else? Just passing through. All right. The Lotus Blossom? Was that the place where we gotta go? God, I swear I have goldfish brain today. I got up early like an adult, and now my brain is just like sort of functional. Lotus Blossom, I did hear that correctly. And I got 13 experience points. Ooh. Ooh. That could cause a lot of problems for these guys. Potentially, potentially. I can max out Haggle. Max out stealth. I need two more points to improve aspects. Or max out thaumaturgy. That'd be highly amusing. Position. That could be re really hostile. Could increase my damage, increase my strength. That could be nice. Actually, this boosts two. That boosts one. That boosts one. Uh, let's boost our strength. Sure, why not? Where the fuck is the lotus blossom? Well, that looks like a lotus magical let me guess that guy looks sketchy as shit love me a back entrance Hello, 
Oops. Those look like Tong. steel. Nice watch. Oh yeah, I'm gonna kill his ass. <clears throat> Come on back, fucker. Have a sword. Damn, what is your patrol route, dude? That's my fault. This is a, a long way around to doing this.
Not a shot fired, and I'm fully fueled. We're doing great. Fun. They've got filming rooms. Hello? Money envelope. 250. I'll take it. We've almost got two grand! Now if I can say that in real life. Thank you, sir. <laughs> Looks like we've just got like one or two other guys. I might as well clear the place out. Then again, I cleared out the upper floor, so I shouldn't have to worry about it. And he's chill again. So we should be good. In there. You son of a bitch! I can't! I can't breathe in here! And you should be glad. Yeah, that's why I'm getting you out. What? Aren't you a little tall for a tongue? What? Tall. You know, like, not short. Jesus. All you thugs are the same. Stupid, stupid, and stupid. Man, the mouth of you. The mouth on you. Are you Wong Ho's kid? Yeah, I'm Kiki. Who the hell are you? The Tong Welcoming Committee? Yeah, your old man sent me to bust your ass out of here. Oh, I'm so impressed. What? Like you want me to thank you or something? In your dreams, asshole. Keep talking like that, I'll keep your ass in that closet. Okay, okay. Man, you don't have to get all sensitive. I'm sorry, okay? There we go. Let's move.
Man's just enjoying his bath. I'm not about to ruin that guy's day. Oh. This one was marked. It looks like that was the only marked one. Okay. What happened? your business, David. You done farting around at the door? Jackass. Fucking hate escort quests. What's up? All right, got that squared away. Thank God. Was there second floor? See ya. Ooh. Come on. Hey, Andrea. What? No, he's not. No, he's not. Oh, I'm no, he's so not. It... Uh, hold on. Don't you have something else to say? Just forget I saved you. Hey, Serena. Did you hear about Joe and yes, he is. Yes, he is. Oh, Howdy, sir. Welcome, my friend. I, I owe you a debt of Andrea gratitude. All, no, you not. have yes, returned to me my greatest treasure. Kiki told me how you rescued her. You are a man of great courage and honor. Thank you. It was the least I could do. Of course. Did you ever find out why the Tong took her? No. I have not been able to find out why they took Kiki. But I fear that it goes much deeper than the tongue. What do you mean? For a long time, I have been trying to clean up Chinatown. It was a difficult job, but the community came together, and we started to take back our streets from criminals like the Tong. Businesses reopened. Families moved back into their homes. <sighs> the Tong looks stronger than ever. Yes. I thought that the Tong were almost gone, but then something happened. Their numbers began to grow, and suddenly they had a lot of money to buy weapons. With them followed the drugs and the violence. It is almost worse now than before. Someone's got to be bankrolling them. I do not know, but there is a change in the air. I meditate, but my spirit is restless. The words of the I Ching are dark and unclear. Everything seemed to change as soon as... Uh, what? As soon as what? I am sorry. I have said too much. Wong Ho, you saw my effectiveness saving your daughter. If there's something I can do to fix this, you can trust me. Well, things seemed to change as soon as Ming Xiao arrived and reopened the Temple of Golden Virtue. 
That was three years ago. I do not mean to insinuate that she has anything to do with the resurgence of the Tong. The two events merely seem to coincide. In my line of life, some people say there are no coincidences. No. I will hear no more of it. Ming Zhao has been my trusted advisor ever since she arrived. I trust her completely. All right, as you wish. I need some information from you. Of course. What can I help you with? I'm looking for someone who's gone missing in your neck of the woods. Who is this person? His name is Barabbas. He's an old friend of mine. He's a business associate. Hmm. What else can you tell me about him? <sighs> He's in surveillance technologies. He's a real night owl. Kind of pasty, withdrawn. I see. I do not think I could find him for you, but I know someone who could. Cool. Where do I find him? His name is Zhao. He is the man who called me and told me where Kiki was being held. Zhao has many connections. He owns an import-export warehouse in Chinatown. Go and see him there. I will call ahead and tell him to expect you. Thanks, Wong Ho. I appreciate it. Stank ass. All right, so we can go to the warehouse. Oh, 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 I almost forgot something. I'm not sure if we can still get it, but we can try. Uh, we actually need to head back to Hollywood, if we can. Hop in. Sure. I'm hoping we can still get it. So, my buddy... Every fucking time, I swear. I was asking a buddy of mine about the uh, Tap Hotel VHS. And he said, oh yeah, it's in the theater. What? The Chinese theater you can go to in Hollywood. If we're lucky, we can still go inside. Oh, thank the Emperor. That's a great vibe. Hey. I had no idea. There it is. Videotape. Tap Hotel. Shuffle Step. Ha <laughs> ha! This would have been a great room to have a boss fight with that guy. In an actual theater part of the theater. I wonder if there are any other goodies hidden here. We got the tape. That's what I was hoping for. <clears throat> That's what I was hoping for. Alright, we've been in there. We can just go back to the car. I've got close to two grand in cash, which is great feeling. Do not have... As you kill enemies, the chalice will fill with blood. Dope. Going somewhere? Away from here. We're going to downtown. Uh, let's see if... 
Vixen. No. Uh oh. Sorry. I cannot remember her name for the life of me. I think it's Vixen. We're gonna go to confession and get paid, but first we're gonna go here to drop off the tape in our mailbox, and then check our mail to see if there's any side quests. We're staying busy. Give. Home. Hey there. Check your haven and emails later. Okay. Don't have any quests anymore in Santa Monica. Downtown. Pisha is still hoping at some point we break into somewhere named the Giovanni Mansion and can steal a book. Gary will give us a poster later. In Chinatown, we need to meet up with... Oh, somebody. Jiminy. Hey there. There we go. It's nice having an oh shit stash of blood. I think the loading screen should trigger it. the right tape, right? Yeah. That was Tap Hotel. Oh. Well. This is the wrong way. Yep, this is the wrong way. Pretty sure there aren't any more side quests with the Anarchs. Very much the wrong way. Fuck me. Should be able to bullshit my way past this way. There we go. Hey, buddy. My man. Let's do some shopping. Got some loot. Yep. Let us sell the fancy watch. Don't need that. Don't need that. Why do I still have the nameplate? Hmm. Got some cool stray shit in here. All right, firearms-wise, I do not need the Mac-10, so it's always fun to loot it. Magnum ammo, I might as well buy two boxes. This is nice to have. Spaz-15 ammo. Do, 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 do. You don't sell that, actually. Uzi 9mm. We have full ammo. Dope. Have a good one, homie. Money, right? Come back in a few nights. No problem. I don't see enough sitting out there. Venus, there we go. I don't know why I thought her name was Vixen. Uh, I wonder if it's because of the mailbox I put it in. 
I would hope not. That's clearly my new haven. Yeah, don't mind the dude in the nice suit who just picked up an old school, like, big ass boxy TV like it was nothing. Bless you, goodness. Where to? Away from here. Uh, back to Chinatown. It might be an issue with what mailbox I put it in. Need a ride? Yeah, just drive. Damn it. So I probably have to drop it off in the mailbox at... Fuck's sake. At Santa Monica. I was hoping to avoid going back there. Because normally it's like you put it in the mailbox, the quest completes and it's good to go. No, it's gone. Uh-oh. Yeah! Email. Thirteen. Enjoying the film, boss, but I think I really let myself go over the years. Alright, this seems to be this seems to be your bag, so here's the deal. Know that Toreador Vesuvius. You know that Toreador and Vesuvius, Miss Velour, back when she was breathing, it was more like Miss Anything for 300, and I got a poster. We'll trade for a revealing photo I saw on Haunted LA. Aha! Uh -huh. Oh my. It's rather lewd. All right, what do I not need currently? Plus one to your wits. Now I might as well hold on to that. I don't need the plaque. I'm not sure if I need the throwing star. I like having all the cool magic shit. Yeah, all right. That's fair, fair. Oh, wait, I have the photo from her. Mmm, that's back at Santa Monica. Uh-oh. Game crashed. Game was about to crash because I stepped through the door before the door could open. Fun. Fucking fun. But I needed to head to Santa Monica anyways if I'm going to get that photo, so I'll do that. Damn! Physics! To just drive. What's the hops, bro? Same shift, different day. I really wish y'all didn't spawn right there. It makes my shit nervous. Really does. Oh yeah, and I can check with Mercurio, see if he's got any goodies. You got a rocket launcher. Okay.
Hmm. No blood. Take the photo. Take... Don't need that. Don't need that. Alright, email. Alright. We'll trade for a revealing photo I saw on Haunted LA. So I don't think the autograph photo is what we're aiming for. Haunted LA, Haunted LA. That would be the one guy in downtown, his apartment. He was the fucker that ran Haunted LA. I can try the photo she gave me. I don't think that'll work, though. So I'll save. <laughs> Probably not. Loading screen. There we go. I'm just trying to cheese this shit. Nope. So it's not that. Alright, cool. Cool, cool, cool. So we gotta go to downtown, break back into that guy's apartment again. Fun. I got a good amount of cash. I should try and... I should get some more blood packs. Just like, just to have some good oh shit buttons, you know? Yeah. That's a safe bet. Need a fix? Yeah, yeah, yeah. There we go. Alright. Good amount of normal blood, good amount of snazzy blood, and we've got an Elder Vitae. Dope. That's right, that is such an arbitrary fucking thing. It's like, well, the regular blood and the snazzy blood, you can have, uh... You can have ten of each, but Elder Vita No, 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 no. That shit's explosive. You can only carry five at a time. Because we only have, like, five or six in the entire fucking game. Fuck you. How about that shit? Fuck you. Arbitrary ass. I think he was at the skyline. Yeah. Yeah, that sounds right. He's at that apartment building right there. It was like second floor. Because clearly a foreign developer made this game. Milligan, yep. Or is Haunted L.A. like something I can visit in Hollywood? I don't know.
Yeah, here it is. No. Need new furniture, sofa, shop at Sofa King. We are Sofa King great. <laughs> we are Sofa King great. Cute. Yeah, he's very dead. Uh, no new emails. Might as well loot the rest of this place while I'm at it. I mean, I'm here. This is the one guy we found dead. That was fun. Oh, goodies. Yep. I don't want to fart around in the vents. I really don't. Three should be the one chick that got him killed. Oh fuck, what was the password? I can't remember. Four. This is a plot door. All right. Five. Nice. Very snazzy. Fridge is open. Very snazzy. Ugh. Who the fuck gets zebra print? Seriously? Okay, now I might as well take the vent since that seems to be the only way down. safe. We're going to be breaking in there eventually. Oh! Safe. <laughs> Unlock. You'll be fine. It's 
really bright burning candle. Oh, here's the one dead chick's room. Okay. Cool. Nice. Oops. Alright. I don't think we'll take fall damage. I'd rather not find out. We. on TV. Odds are footage of his place will be worth something eventually. Oh. Sean Milton, slob, never really has chicks over. Some guy's been staying with him lately. So I haven't wanted to watch much. Georgia Welsh, rich broad is pretty hot. Password on the door is 9648, so maybe I'll sneak in there and steal some panties to auction off online. 9648... Apartment 4, vacant, no reason to keep an eye on this one. Apartment 5, Paul Anderson, thought there was no reason to watch him, but I caught him upstairs, I'll keep the tape rolling. Apartment 6, Hannah Glazer, the gold mine, something hot's always going down in there. That's something he's usually Hannah herself. Bastard. Hey Tom, sounds like we got a deal. You keep sending in the security footage, I'll pay you for the good stuff. Cute. Very cute. Noteworthy. Oh, but I got a way out to the street. I wonder if we can actually spot the hidden cameras. That'd be an interesting touch. Okay. That was amusing. Didn't find it there. Not sure where the Haunted LA poster is. Because the signed photo clearly didn't do shit. I should probably look it up. That would make the most sense. I'll look it up after. Bless you. But we're going to Chinatown. Hop in. Sure. Okay. So. Uh, Zhao Warehouse, okay. Got six experience points. That's a good feeling. So where the hell's the warehouse? Is there a map? J 
Jow's imports. The opposite end of where I'm at. Okay, cool. Dope. Above the textures. Cool. Let's explore a little bit. What kind of bullshit can we get up to? Golden Ocean Fish Market. And it's locked. Alright, I have a lockpick, so. sake. Alright. What's our trouble we got going on in here? Ooh, this is a shootout room. Car stereo. This is a trap. You see all this. Ah, we do take fall damage very, very slightly. Wang Ho called. You're looking for someone. Hmm. You shall. I don't know where your friend is, but I know the Tong are involved. The leader of the Tong, Johnny. He'll know where they are. And where do I find Johnny? Johnny's at Glaze. It's his club. You'll need a password to enter. The password is 725. There will be Tong everywhere. Johnny's office is upstairs. Thanks. Why are you helping me? I am a man of my word, and I owe the debt to Wong Ho. By paying that debt, I have made an enemy of the Tong, who I once belonged to. What are you going to do now? You should leave now. We know it was you. I was just about to say the same thing. Excuse me. Oh, there it is. I was wondering, it's like, why am I taking so much fucking damage?
Did he survive? Hey, he did. If you want to find your friend, I suggest you hurry. Why are those movable? All right, hold on. Full ammo. We gotta go to Club Glaze. 728 was the code. I should have written it down. Hey, we survived the ambush and kept Zhao alive. Didn't gain any humanity from that, though. Hold on, hold on. Seven two five. Glaze. What the fuck is glaze? It's probably relatively close. What are the odds? Hey. Nobody allowed upstairs. Hey. Guess I'll find another way then. do this without a big commotion. There's a door right behind him. Is it that easy?
that's going to be my best angle. Since you feel the need to be a fucking headache. You had to kill him, didn't you? It's part of your code of survival, covering your tracks, so to speak. And before you attempt to deceive me, you should know I'm monitoring your heat signature. It's room temperature. And you are... I also must protect my true identity. You may refer to me as the Mandarin. You are searching for one of your kind, I understand. I have him at my facility. Come to the Fu Syndicate building. We will discuss terms of release. I'm coming. <laughs> There we go. So they have a syndicate building? It's a bit ham-fisted. Pardon. Ooh, you drain quick. You are very, very homeless. Holy shit. Ooh. Where does this go? I have no context of that building, but there's a dead guy in the fridge. Okay. Where's the syndicate building? It's probably that. I don't think so. Yep, it's the big tall building right there. That's the Foo Syndicate.
Alright. This should go well. So glad you finally decided to show up. If you want to meet your comrade, walk through those doors. No, bring him here, then we'll talk. Subject will not enter the next area. This may be due to a theoretical sixth sense, or perhaps it is simply a fray. Are you stubborn by nature or instinct? What is this place? Subject is uncooperative. This may be a side effect of its condition, or a residual personality defect. Step through the doors. All right. Good. I am told you are a rather resourceful individual. This should make you a most intriguing specimen. You and your kind may play mortals for weaklings and fools, and that may be fitting for some. But you underestimate me. Oh, boy. I know that sound. Subject is male. Appearance suggests early to late twenties. True age unknown. As with the other, there are no vital signs. No heartbeat, no body heat. Test chamber air sample is 97% carbon monoxide. Normal respiration cannot take place. Subject is by all definition Clinically dead? Hello in there. I'm going to run some tests on you. I'm interested in how you work, but only because it's my task to find the most efficient way to kill your kind. Please, give me everything you've got. Begin the experiment. Test chamber has been filled with ultraviolet light, releasing moderate UV radiation. Does that burn at all? Subject exhibits no sign of pain or even physical discomfort. Shut down the lights. Conclusion, UV radiation does not produce the desired effect. Please, move on to the next chamber. If you cooperate, I... Your mind is resourceful. Your survival instinct borders on animalistic. I'm curious about your innate abilities. Let us see what you can do. The walls are reinforced concrete, several feet thick. There is no other exit. Believe me, it is my design. Seriously? Only the most simple creatures can survive dismemberment. I am told you can regenerate parts of your body. I'd much like to observe this. I wonder how many limbs can you lose before you cease to function? Great resilience so far. Let's see how you do against some live targets. Proceed to the next room. Sometimes myths are constructed around legitimate observations. Let us find out if there's any truth in an old superstition. Initiate Van Helsing experiment. Does that hurt? I'd rather Van Helsing hypothesis tests false. Well, when God fails, Put your faith in the gun. Proceed, Commander.
What is it doing? Belmont team, really? You continue to endure even though it's my instruction to incapacitate you. This calls for Continue to the next room. I'm very enthusiastic about this next test. Many regimes use electricity to torture information out of their captive. It would be useful if this applies to your kind as well. Or will the voltage have results similar to fire? Let's find out. Considerable mental and physical acumen. And I'm quite perplexed how something that should be dead can display such strong survival skills. Let's begin the final test. Step into the next room. I'm gonna ruin your fucking day, Bucko. Stand by. Run a check on the extinguishers one more time. I've already determined fire is a weakness of your kind. I would like to know more about the psychological effect it has on you, and how it will be exploited. There's gotta be a way to fuck with this. Yeah, you're complacent in this shit. this squashed odious chalice experimented on to the point of being unusable interesting so you're sturdy all right come here come here come here, come here, come here. You have killed the Mandarin. Yeah, up yours, Tony Stark. <laughs> All right, let's put that next point into Auspex, except. I'll get to you. Hold on. I'm looting this place.
Bobo Wakazashi. Whoa. That can't be good. Was there another door? Killed that. Got that. Broke into here. Alright. Oh, I should be wearing my leathers. Especially since I'm, like, running and gunning. Hey, buddy! Why are you all electriced out? Let me out! Wait a minute. Get me out of here! I'm not one of them. They get you too. Now I've got no excuse. A Nosferatu getting caught by a bunch of humans. <sighs> this is a new low. Barbarous, I presume. Gary sent me to get you. Wait. We can't go yet. There are servers here. We need to hack in and delete all of their research. Should be a mainframe on this floor. Agreed. Leave it to me. Not a computer I can't crack. Let's check the computers. Anything on Kindred needs to get wiped. Anyone interferes, you leave them to me. Alright, let's go delete that shit. Let's go. Let's go. Excuse you. Hello. An actual katana. Busting it. Harmful if swallowed. Hint book. Raises your melee skill. I have max melee. Elimination status. What is the current status of the project? A new subject was delivered to you last week. If you do not see results by the end of the month, you understand the consequences. Article 2. The elimination of Wong Ho's imminent Kiki's daughter will also be liquidated as per Article 2A. Whoa! Okay... Redam. Hey, stop right there. Oops. Try me, bitch. Seven three three seven. Cute. 
Let's go. I'm happy with you actually just vibing right there. It means I can guarantee you live. Perch. Y'all fuck's just gonna keep spawning. That was the last of them. Let's get out of here. You need to contact Gary right away. He needs to know you're okay. Will do. And thanks. My pleasure. I'm genuinely appreciative that you got stuck on a door. Actually, let me just... Just in case. Should be good. Can't exactly salvage the data. Huh. Insular necromancers. Interesting. Hello there. Do you have Prince Albert in the cam? Well, better let him go, boss. <laughs> you done real well bringing our boy back home. I got your info, hero. Fire away. The same information I gave your prince, I also for a bit of juicy gossip. You both had an equal opportunity to take it. They just had a bit more initiative. Tell me where to find the Giovanni, and I won't mention this to the prince. Oh, I wouldn't want that, boss. What's he going to do? Comb the underworld with his raggedy foot soldiers? He needs me as an ally more than an enemy. Then tell me about the Giovanni. Tell me a secret about him. The Incaran sarcophagus isn't the only occult item they're hoarding. I hear they've got a connection that would make Alistair Crowley come back from the dead. That is, assuming he isn't already sitting on a shelf somewhere over there. <laughs> Where do I find them? I'll take my chances. That sounds like a lot of opposition. <laughs> that sounds like a lot of opposition. Good. <laughs> Am I the only one who saw this coming a million miles away? Seems so. <laughs> you get him, boss. You give him one for Gary. If you should survive and ever need any information, come back and see me. I'm always here. I'll remember that. Take care. All 
right. Giovanni Mansion. I, you know, I have no idea if there's any actual shops in this part of town. I should probably explore a little. Hmm. Hi there. Hey! Welcome to Sang's Herbal Remedies. I am Sang. How may I assist you? You don't seem like the you don't seem like the type to sell herbal remedies. Selling remedies is honest work. I came to America after discharge from Chinese um, uh, herbal remedies forces to help aging parents with store. Definitely, I am now American citizen. God bless the allegiance flag. Right. I know you're in the military. <coughs> no anything about guns. Chinese invented gunpowder. Yes, I know guns. Got any? Hold on, please. These are good remedies for many problems. No credit cards. Excellent. Let's see what you got. My man. <laughs> we got a crossbow. And a shitty shingunto. Oh, pyro crossbow. Actually, I need as much shotgun ammo as possible. I am... I do not need the Ithaca. The Ithaca sucks. Heavy leather. Heavy leather clothing has an armor rating of three. Hinders movement. Minus one penalty to dex. Yes, please, and thank you. I gotta get the crossbow. That's just too silly. Yeah, 30 rounds of crossbow ammo. That's just the right level of silly. There we go. Uzi rounds. We got we got a good amount of Uzi ammo. Not worried about that. Welcome back. Oh, okay, it's just different ways of getting into the same menu. We got a good amount of Glock ammo. Have a good one, buddy. I like him. I like him a lot. I need to reload my firearms. So they are all types of sketchy, eh? Was the wrong button to press. You're going to get through this whole game without a masquerade violation. Excuse you. All right, we got the pyro crossbow. Highly fucking amusing. Retrieve it. Sheet. I've got 13 experience, so I can actually max out my firearms or my stealth. Or my dex. Or my stamina. Yeah, stamina, which is like a nice defensive bonus. Oh, yeah, we got the final outfit. Coat. Yeah, that tracks. I like his hairstyle went weird though. Shoot. That only improves my bashing resistance. I should probably boost. That costs twenty. 15, 20. This only costs 15. In tremendous distance. I could probably max out. Now let's max out firearms since we're going to be in the shit, as it were. Alright. Saving it. 
Going somewhere? Away from here. The Giovanni Stronghold. Yeah, what is it? This is the Giovanni Mansion. Giovanni? Oh, yeah, here's the place. I haven't met you before. Are you a family member, member of the family? Yes, I am. Is that right? Fellow of a family to be born into or married into or both. You have an invitation with you? Oh, God, no, I don't. Hey, don't worry about it. I'm sure they'll let you in. Just tell him and me. Just tell him you. Just tell him you lost it. <laughs> I lose things all the time. I believe that. I'll do that. I'm sorry. I don't think we've met. Maria. Maria Rosalini. Maybe I'll see you inside, Maria. Yes. What is it? Is your wife okay? She'll be fine after I get a pot of coffee in her. I don't know, maybe. Maybe you should take her home. Well, she did pretty much cause the last function to come to a screeching halt. That woman has the self-control of a cubescent chimpanzee. You better hurry up. I think she's about to lose her stomach. Come on, Maria. We're going home. <laughs> Probably just save them from a world of headache. So. Alright, that might have actually worked. You have invitation. Yes, I do. Here you go. Mm. Please have a wonderful time. Thank you. <sighs> Most of them spend their lives as ghouls. Jesus. Uh, save before I cause any headaches. Might as well be a costume party. Everyone's smiling, pretending this isn't a pageant put on by the patriarch of this family. Fine. But this is a contest, and I came to win. Victor, please make your acquaintance. Hmm. Mira. Mira Giovanni. So what do you mean this is a contest? They gather us up here to decide just who's the best and brightest of this generation is. The lucky few are given the real power in this family. But some of us need to win more than others. Oh, forget it. You wouldn't understand. Do you need help? Actually, I'll spare no expense for a lock. I want to be in that circle of power. And I won't let blood get in the way. And of course, when your time comes, I'll pay back the favor. What do you mean, circle of power? Uncle Bruno. Since I was a kid, he's been the patriarch of this family. Except he hasn't aged today. I met with a senator from Massachusetts who asked me if I was related to Bruno Giovanni. Said Uncle Bruno helped him with his first campaign back in 1950. We've all heard the rumors. The core of our family, they never age. They're secretive. Whispers of blood magic and a kiss. Whatever it is, they pick the very best of us for it. I'd do anything to be picked. I've made some errors in judgment. But I've lobbied hard for this family's interests. What do you mean, errors in judgment? What? Forget it. I'm not saying anything about that. Well, if I hear anything about your relatives, I'll fill you in. Casually looting the place. Cute.
course they have a nice pool. They always have an expensive pool. This will take me back outside, probably. They turned to necromancy out of perverse boredom. Sorry, you can't come in here right now. Sorry, you can't come in here right now. Fuck. We got a little lake thing? What is this? How you doing, Lumpy? Alright, let's try this side of the house. The sword opens a door! Thank you, sir. Bad monkey, no banana. You squint at the wiggly markings on the page. We can't make out what they say. Despite this, someone in the back... Something in the, in the back of your mind is say... It's thinking they say illiterate dumbass. I need a dodge of four. I need six more points of dodge before I can use the book. Okay. Illiterate dumbass. Fuck you, game. Might have heard something. Yes. Hello, goodbye. <laughs> Do I just talk to people? Uh, hi. I'm, um... <laughs> Victor Rossellini. You? Nadia Milliner. It's a pleasure to meet you, Victor. Are you from the Chicago Rossellinis? That's correct. Oh, you must give my regards to Great Aunt Frances when you get back. I stayed with her last time I was out that way. She was very sweet to me. I will. What do you do? I'm working on my master's out here. I'm from back east. The Giovannis have been nice enough to let me stay here while I finish up my studies. I've learned a great deal from them, like you wouldn't believe. For example? I, um, I really can't say much about that. 
Oh, come on. You can tell me. We're... I know a little about our family secrets. The dead tell you tales, too. There's something I want to show you, but you absolutely can't tell anyone. All right, go ahead. this place thoroughly. Giovanni book. There we go. I forgot to double check. Is the katana 39, 36 base damage to feed adjustment I'm going to stick with the broadsword. That feels more like my aesthetic. Oh, fun. Known experience modifier. Saulacept. What is a Saulacept? Tidal chorus of whispers washes across your thoughts. They seem to be offering guidance, but their message eludes your conscious mind. Their motivations are unknown, but you find yourself increasingly willing to submit to their guidance. As long as you possess Saulacept, you'll gain an extra point of experience every time you award a three or more. It may or may not have other effects. What do you think the game's gonna start treating me like a uh, fucking? Genteel and well mannered. Yeah. This should be good. I just got stray miscellaneous crap soaking up my inventory space. So at least I got a pea coat. Ooh. 
Yeah, I'm not up to that shit. Really not up for that shit. There's switches in these alcoves, or is it just cool? Concerningly large area. Oh, okay. switches yeah yeah that's about right was the point. No wonder the clan hides its blasphemous secrets as well. Whoa. Hello, sarcophagus. Kindred, your presence here violates the agreement between our leaders. Leave now. Or face the consequences of your actions. Let's discuss the problem, whatever it may be. There is an alliance between your leader Lacroix and Mistress Ming Zhao. You violate the agreement. If you do not leave, we are not responsible for your death. I gotta get a publicist. What alliance? What are you talking about? We'll give you one more chance to leave this place and keep your life. You will go? Alright, you double dragon refugees. Let's do this thing. The time for decisions has passed. We Chang brothers accept your life graciously. Yeah, you won't get it.
Fucking hell. No, that is a nice katana. Oh, that is the same katana. Oh, yeah, I got my squeaky bottle. There we go. <gasps> that went well. Think, man. You've got 11 experience. I'm gonna save up for uh, max level thaumaturgy. Boss? My wunderkind returns. In my entire court, I knew there was only one who could have succeeded in this task. Finally, the Ankaran sarcophagus is ours. Come, I've granted Beckett's request to study and document all the markings of the sarcophagus. You've met Beckett, haven't you? Let's go take a look inside and see what the commotion around the city has really been all about. Before we do that, I need an answer. Are you in an alliance with Guijin? What? Preposterous! No kindred would trust them, nor would they trust us. Did Jack tell you that? Because it sounds like you've been taken for a fool. I was told by agents sent to steal the sarcophagus. And you believed them? They've been trying to take over L.A. for years. It's a ruse, a falsehood, spread to undermine my rule and turn kindred against each other, thin our ranks. They are duplicitous, evil creatures. Did they not try to kill you? They did. Insurance. They lied to you in case you lived through the encounter. They hoped to create dissension in the ranks. Rumors. It's a trick older than you or I. Let's just open the sarcophagus. What have you assessed so far? Unfortunately for the Heralds of Doom, it appears we won't be opening Pandora's box. The markings, as far as I can tell, are of Assyrian origin. An extraordinary piece, but nothing earth-shattering. I see. Then there is no good reason why we shouldn't open it. <clears throat> oh, budge. Beckett, do you see any mechanism for the lid? I haven't as yet had a chance to pour over it with my fine-tooth comb. I think I have one in my bag. <laughs> why won't it... Why won't it open, Beckett? And you? I thought you said it looked as if it had been opened on the Dane. I want it open! You. You and Beckett, figure out a way to open it. I need to know what's inside. I have other matters to attend to. Come get me when a solution has been found. Ah, the depths to which I'll sink to prove others wrong. The young ones get so temperamental. Fortunately for Sebastian, is it? I'd already made up my mind to open the sarcophagus, if only to show the city that Gehenna, contrary to popular belief, has not begun. 
What do you think's inside? Put your ear to it. I'll shake it, and you tell me what you think's inside. Cute. All right, stupid question. How do you think we crack it open? Hmm. Fortunately for us, I know of someone who has distinguished himself in this field. The guy in the historical network with a pith helmet? <laughs> who? His name is Dr. Anders Johansson, a professor of archaeology from Norway. He was the one responsible for finding the sarcophagus, and as far as I know, the only authority on its origin and design. Where do we find him? Until yesterday, he could have been found in his suite at the Empire Hotel downtown. But when I stopped by earlier this evening, all I found was spilt coffee on a morning paper. It appears he's been abducted. That's not good. Hopefully he left some notes or a diagram or something. I did find a pair of bikini swimwear and a book detailing the origins of various Turkish dialects. Smart, that all? I detected the scent of myrrh incense, which is usually burned in monasteries. Also, I found beach sand in part of a muddy footprint. Putting two and two together, I located a monastery near a beach in Malibu, where I believe hunters are holding Johansson captive. Hunters? How did you... Actually, there were two hunters on the roof of the building opposite the hotel who were positively delighted to tell me everything they knew, provided I stopped dangling them headfirst over the side. Hunters have this guy. You killed him, right? No. Only the stupid and careless get caught by hunters. They serve their purpose in the natural order. Fair enough. So what do we do now? The hunters abducted Dr. Johansson for his own protection. Or at least that's how they've justified it. He's being held by the Society of Leopold and used, quite ingeniously, as bait for Prince LaCroix's minions. I gotta make sure to insert the Leopold click, clip from Looney Tunes. Society of Leopold... Sebastian mentioned you ran into one of the hunters from the Society of Leopold some time ago. They're so secret a church organization, I don't even think they know if they exist. But essentially, they're murderers for Christ, or some such deity. Right. So how do we get them out? You'll have to go to the monastery and find a way into the tunnels beneath where the hunters are holding Johansson. I'm afraid I can't accompany you, but then it's best you go alone. Too many of us might set them off, like fundamentalists on contrary opinion. <laughs> Shot fired? So how do I get in there? I wouldn't recommend walking. Certainly Sebastian's already provided cab fare. I'm sure he always spares no expense when archaeology is at stake. Right. I'll be back after I go to the monastery. Remember, Dr. Johansson is an innocent. He has no idea we actually exist. Try not to put the idea in his head. Got it. How are you holding up, Lumpy? You doing good, man? He's doing good. There we go. A handbook from Les Assassins de Roulent. A Quebecois terrorist organization hidden under an innocent cover. This manual holds the secrets to dodging bullets, trains, and other projectiles. Yes. Yes. Did you find a way to open the sarcophagus? Getting the sarcophagus back was quite an expensive ordeal. I can't have my protege looking plebeian, can I? You'll find I can be very generous towards those who serve me well. I'm gonna milk you for every cent. Did I mention I had to slink through sewers, China fit town, fight a Zimis? Point made. Thanks. You made a wise investment. Now it's time for me to pay off. Yes. <laughs> Just casually hand me 500 bucks. And there's the magic book. Voce del Morte. 
What a shit show. Oh, d does Chunk have anything to say? How you doing, Chunk? Uh, I'm sorry there, but Mr. LaCroix, he told me not to let anybody up right now. He sounded kind of... Hey, no problem, Chunk. Take care, man. Yeah, I'm not about to put his job at risk with a, for a persuasion check. The Society of Leopold. Leopold. <laughs> That's all I can fucking think is the Leopold clip from Looney Tunes. Cause I grew up with an old cut like VHS tape of that shit. For some reason my brain keeps wanting me to say cassette tape, but that is decidedly the wrong type of tape. No. There we go. Whee! Hey, evil bitch, how you doing? Yes. Here's the book you asked for. The Voce del Morte. The Giovanni never willingly share their secrets, and I've had little success infiltrating their strongholds. How did you obtain this? Eh, don't worry about it. Just give me what you promised. It will take some time to translate and unlock the secrets of this. I will have to move on from this city to evade any Giovanni seeking it. Take this. This will complete the terms we agreed to, and I think it is adequate compensation. It is the key of Alamut. It instills dread in those that would harm you, and makes it harder for them to strike you. Make no mistake, our dealings do not make us allies. If indeed we meet again, do not ask me for any favors. I will give you this final advice, however. Leave this city. These are its final nights. Discord looms heavy. I've felt this before. What do you mean? In November of 1938, I was translating documents in Leipzig, Germany, written by a purported Crusades-era necromancer. There also, I felt a sense of impending chaos. Soon after was the Kristallnacht. The wellspring of a new world war. I see. I'll take it into consideration. Take care. So what did I get? Key of Alamut. One of the only handful still in existence, the Key of Alamut gives its owner extraordinary resistance to damage. Nice. Increase all soak ratings by one. Fuck yeah. Yeah. All right, cool. Let's get back up there. All right. Feels good, man. This way. Wait, 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 wait. Yeah, those are just foldy chairs. Okay. Cool. Cool, cool, cool. Two hours and 11 minutes in. We went a little bit over. That's fine. Doperoni. This was fun. I had a lot of fun. Hope you guys had fun too. I need to do a bit of homework, figure out where the hell... Well, actually, I can sell this shit to tons of fun over there. I need to do a little bit of homework, figure out where the hell I can get the poster, or if I already have the card, if that was the correct decision to make. I think it was. But we'll find out. Yeah, we've got some shit to sell. We've got side quests for uh, Bertram. No, the other one. Gary. My man. I need to do some shopping, homie. Whoa. You have a shtaya. I would be happy to sell the Remington for a Steyr. Oh yeah, I have claws. Uh, hold on, hold on. Sell the silver ring, sell the fancy ring, sell the fancy watch, sell the car stereo, sell the morphine. And the gold ring. There we go. Alright, hold on. We got a bush hook.
Why can't I sell those? I don't need those. Someone might need the odious chalice. I don't know. I've got sixteen hundred dollars. Fucking majestic. I would not need the Ingram or the I Am I Uzi with a Steyr. Frankly, I don't need the Remington. Uh, feet 6, base 5, 2, 4, 3, 6. So, yeah, we need the Remington, unfortunately. 3, 6, yeah. Two, three. Yes. Get some shotgun ammo. Now we're at max shotgun ammo. There we go. <gasps> Thanks, buddy. Feels good, man. Feels good. I'm back down to one page of inventory items. Yeah. Yeah. We're doing great. <laughs> okay, we've got some side quests to do. I got a, some homework to do. Hope you guys had fun with Let's Play Vampire the Masquerade Bloodlines. Unfortunately, we're out of time for today. So until we meet again, stay classy, Internet!